Lawmakers in the Lagos State House of Assembly are confident Lagos would soon become a major tourist destination with the passage of the Tourism Promotion Agency Bill. The bill was passed shortly after it scaled third reading on the floor of the House. Lagos Assembly correspondent Abimbola Agbebi has details. It is my honor to read for the third time a bill for a law to provide for the establishment of the Lagos State Tourism Promotion Agency and for connected purposes. After two years of legislative tinkering, the bill to establish the Lagos State Tourism Promotion Agency was finally passed into law. It seeks to make Lagos a major tourism destination. What do we do in order to cleanse where we travel there? It's just to make sure that we you know, enjoy the tourist uh, attractions in those countries. So why can't we develop our uh, uh, the tourist centers in Lagos State? You understand? And we cannot just do, develop it in vacuum. So we, own, we need law to do it. And that's why the State House of Assembly has, you know, take it upon itself to pass this law. The state government is worried Lagos waters and its many tourist potentials are not being put to maximum use. Lagos we have what we call tourist attraction site centers within the state. But we have not really captured it the way it has been captured, like if you go to Dubai and if you go to Saudi Arabia, you understand? So after looking at the potentials of the state in terms of tourists in Lagos State, looking at um, Legushi Beach, looking at um, Atikan Beach, looking at our Ayo Festival, the only way we could do now is to establish an, an agency, you understand, that will be saddled with that responsibility of taking up that challenge to showcase the state domestically and internationally. Look at London, as old as it is, a very old city, it's still the number one attraction in the world. Everybody wants to be to London all over, from all over the world. Look at New York. Look at, the, as soon as Dubai is, look at what it has become. But we need to work hard on Lagos, and Lagos can get it, because Lagos has what it takes. I paid a visit to this conservation center in Lekki, one of the many tourist attractions in Lagos. This German tourist, Enzo, is visiting Lagos for the first time with his friends. Lagos is very interesting for me because we in Germany don't have those big trees, palm trees, jungle trees. And the local markets are quite interesting to see. It's a total new experience for me to be in Lagos here. For me, Lagos is a very beautiful place because it's quite close to nature. I can see the real life of people. People are close to each other and it's not so isolated. With the beautiful scenery in here, one can only wonder why several other tourist sites in the state aren't fully explored. This is the Lekki Conservation Center, a natural habitat, one of the tourist attractions here in Lagos that could help boost the economy of Lagos if properly honest. Now, this is one of the benefits the Lagos State Government stands to gain through the passage of uh, a tourism promotion agency bill. Lagos lawmakers are confident the Tourism Promotion Agency law, if assented to by the executive, will promote the state and attract Nigerian and international visitors. Abimbola Agbibi, TVC News, Lagos.